what up everybody hlg in the building and we got us a combat cast about to start in less than three minutes i hope you're having a beautiful day welcome into the combat cast watch party for ermac and then after we get done we're gonna be doing a little look at ermac in the previous mortal kombat games he was in mortal kombat trilogy he was in mortal kombat deception mortal kombat 9 well, he's in armageddon but he was basically a clone of himself in uh, that he was in mortal kombat deception he was in mortal kombat x and we have not seen ermac in a very long time and we're about to get our first look at ermac and i believe mavado what's up steven and steve good to see you in the stream as you join us welcome in headlock squad don't forget to smash that thumbs up share with a friend welcome in steven over on the other platforms Pawal, how are you Y'all ready to take a first look? Ermac hasn't been in Mortal Kombat since Mortal Kombat X. That is absolutely wild. What is up, everyone? Let me make sure we're looking good over here. Let me get the chat bot chat button. There we go. We look good. So how's your day been today, Legends? Welcome into the show. Monad, what's up, buddy? Andy, hello. Grimzilla. Our itty bitty co-host is on the, uh, on the desk here. Hang on. Just joined us. Just joined us. Let me go over here. That's the wrong cam. Just the right one. There you go. No, 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 talk. You can't go back there, bud. You can't go back there. That's wires and stuff, buddy. You don't want to go back there, kitty. That's wires and stuff. What up, Alexander? Tristan, Lucci, what's up, man? You got to pay the light bill. Let me borrow $58. That's a very specific amount, homie. <laughs> what's up, Javon? Welcome into the show. All right, so what do you expect on the combat cast today? Now, thank you for everybody tuning in wherever you're watching from. We're about to get into this. Hold on there, homie. What's up, Alexander? Welcome in. We're also going to be doing a showcase of Mortal Kombat, uh, Ermac on classic Mortal Kombat and some other things. So as you come in, give yourself a big shout out for being here. Make sure you drop a like and a share out there. There you go, kitty. What's up, Ron? Good to see you. So the combat cast is about to start any minute now, and uh, we're going to see our first look at some new moves in the game, some new mechanics. That's your debt. Hey, that ain't bad. So also, there's like a new push block mechanic that I believe is coming to the game. There's a lot going on. We got a new season of invasions. We got Ermac coming. We got new moves for Scorpion, Reptile, Ebony. Hello, welcome to the stream. This is the early surprise stream. Hello, Dwayne and Stream Family Grin. How are you doing today on this early surprise stream? Watching doing... from the workplace. Yo, thank you. In lieu of star screens, I'm gonna do ridiculous stuff like that. Thank you very, very much, Ebony. Y'all let me know if I need to make any audio adjustments. All right, it's already loud as shit. All right. What's up, Drew? How are you doing? Oh, man, Ebony, thank you for the love, Leo. What's up? Don't forget, one of you top three star centers is taking home one of these jackets this month from any stream. We're just on early today. Check out the combat at this. cast starts now. Fantastic. If I need to make any audio adjustments, let me know. Y'all ready to see Ermac for the first time? In a long Hello, time. And welcome to the combat cast, a very exciting combat cast. Um, Ermac, yo! So we are going to show Ermac today. Uh, Ermac has been one of my favorite characters in Mortal Kombat. It's as loud as it goes. Yeah, They're like always so first. quiet. He was, yeah. he was my first main. Yeah, he was yeah. your first main when I met you. Main. Yeah. Um, so very excited to show Ermac. I will be doing it today, which is fun. Oh. So there will be some mess ups, and I'll get some get some help from Let's that. Let's count them out together. Let's count them out. But uh, so I'll be showing Ermac today. Uh, very excited. Before we get started, though, I am Tyler Lansdowne, one of the community managers here at NetherRealm Studios. I'm Derek Kurtzik, one of the designers here at NetherRealm Studios. Stephanie Luch. Brombeck, QA lead. At NetherRealm Studios. Everyone knows <laughs> that. She does What's up, that. Jay? That's, that's become a bit. It's become, it's become a bit now. Um, so here's the deal. We are Before we get started on showing Ermac and talking about some of the stuff that's happening with this update, mm -hmm. let's show the Ermac trailer one more time for those of you who have not seen it. Booyah! Why does he look different? Is he, is he not wearing glasses today or something? Why does he look different, Lucci? Yo, welcome in, Jay. Good to see you. So this is the trailer for Ermac. He's got some new moves uh, that we are seeing. You have in there. shamed the souls of your ancestors. Which what of up, my Ebony, again, thank you for the 100 stars. I'm going to give you the trailer. Thank you, Ebony. I hope they're treating you well at work, too. 
Yo, what's up, Cairo? We gotta catch this. We have to catch this. Absolutely. That is Fight. So that's his grab, I think. There we go. Top three for you. Let me turn my mic up there. There, I gotta, I gotta over talk. You this. might be many, but I am the one. You are not even Earthrealm's champion. That's a good line. I'm not gonna lie. What's up, Gyro? He looks like he's gonna be insane. Changed since we first oh, met. We believe for the better. Oh yeah, you coming back? You coming back, Luchi? Yo, cat, what are you gunning? What are you? Yo, Jay, thank you for the share. Okay, sorry. Nah, he looks crazy. He looks nuts. Also, his grab is almost inescapable. Finish him. He looks OD. Michael, thank you for the brutal share. He looks really, really cool. There it is. Incredible. All right, let's see. A lot of really good responses. A lot of souls. A lot of souls. I love that it's not your typical telekinesis as it's been. No. It's using the souls within him to help him fight which i think is awesome yeah yeah yeah. i, I like the really big monster he's probably that's their cool. audio it's as loud as it goes i'm really excited to have him back as a cameo i have really enjoyed the mavado ermac team up mavado i think is a we'll talk about it later but a really fun new addition for what he can bring to the fight I mean, he's, he's really cool to play with and he's fancy super fancy super fancy really dig him <laughs> um but let's talk a little bit about what's coming up with this patch sure Derek, Marion, thank invasions. you for those stars. DK here talking about invasions. So, um, we've added in a couple new type thank of, you, you new legend. types of encounters. Uh, a combo trial where you have to defeat like a malfunctioning cyborg with a single combo. And also things that we're kind of, we're calling character trials, where we force you okay. into a specific character. That sounds and cool. Have you use their moves Marion, thank to you. Get I'll give you a big thank you in a little bit. Scenario we've put together <laughs> for it. Um, they're a lot of fun. There's there's a tough one out there, and I'm excited for when people actually get to beat it because it's hard. And also, we've made missions more missions optional as well. We don't want people to get like stuck in their progression because why does he look different? Mission might be hard or one thing or another. Mm. We really want to make sure that everybody's able to progress through these, and so we've made more missions optional for players. Yeah, these are really fun. Like a uh, an example would be there's one where there's targets, and Kung Lao, you have to do the hat toss and then aim the hat to hit the target. <laughs> Or you gotta manipulate like sand that. with Garrus, or you've gotta do um, you gotta do special moves with Johnny Cage to, yeah. to avoid things. So there's a Marion, I appreciate the star of love. And uh, we hope you guys enjoy it. During the combat cast, I'm just gonna give you the yeah, sprinkler. I had a lot of fun doing these myself. Um, Thank you. I'm very busy, so I don't get to play the game as much as I used to back in the past. And I, I made time to play all these because I think they're very wacky and funny. Yep. Awesome. Uh, all right, wacky, that? funny. No, all right. No, that's pretty much it. Well, I'm kidding. So, it's the season of the storms. Okay. Raiden is our new invader. And, so Dark uh, Raiden is coming in. Dark Raiden we'll was the that. Raiden. We'll uh, of course, we'll have a new Titan battle mm -hmm. and all our normal shenanigans. Free character trials as well. 
um, in which we've removed the, um, the level requirement to get into the gateway. So as soon as there's a character trial, you can just Fantastic. go right there and not wait to be level five to go into the gateway. Oh, great. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Excellent. Okay. Uh, a couple other things we want to talk about. Uh, King of the Hill is now cross-play. Woo! Yeah. So now you can play with people on different platforms. Whoa, yeah. King of the Hill is cross-play uh, now. That's massive. For your friends from cross-play or first party. Awesome. So yeah. that's, I know people have been asking for that. It's finally here. We're that's a big deal. Uh, I know you do, a lot of people do their tournaments that way and things yep. like yep. that. So that'll be awesome. Glad that that is made it to Mortal Kombat 1. That's uh, a big deal. A couple characters have received maybe some new moves. Very oh, exciting. Yes. Uh, Scorpion might have a new string that's been added. Okay. Uh, Much needed. It'll be fun for a lot of people. Uh, Garrus, for the Garrus players, there's now a UI element at the bottom that shows how many times he's used his countdown. Mm -hmm. So you and the okay. opponent will always know when he's at three. Correct. So yep. that's something people have been asking for, so we got that in there. Uh, Rain. He's got a couple of new moves. Rain has some new moves, um, which is neat. Uh, a Reptile couple. has a new long-range projectile. He yeah, moves. he's got like the MK2 classic <laughs> right. spit that goes full that go screen. Again? That's pretty cool. Right, so he got a full new move for, for him. And he, also his, uh, his drop, you can now cancel out of. Yeah, he kind, kind of, of flips back and goes invisible. Yeah, it's really neat. Wow. Kind of help you with mix-ups and things like that. That's crazy. Uh, one of the big ones, I think, which is going to excite people, is Shijinka. Mm -hmm. Yes, he's been meditating and learning new techniques <laughs> so, this whole time. Yeah. Shijinko has a lot of new techniques that he has learned. We're now going to show you just a little tiny supercut of some of the new stuff that he can do. Is that a thing, a supercut? He's already got a ton of stuff he can do. Uh, so we're going to show that real What's quick. up, Terry? Welcome in, brother. Things that he can do. Let's take a look. So, King of the Hill is crossplay already. <laughs> The only, uh, okay, so he's got the fireballs now. What up, Jimmy? Welcome to the stream. So this new combat cast has been revealing some big stuff so far. Wow. Holy crap, they buffed him to hell, man. He's insane. Yo, if you're just tuning in, when are we getting Ermac? Ermac drops tomorrow. These are the updates to the game. There we go. A lot of neat, cool stuff. Got the uh, Reiko. That's wild. Grab. What yeah. can't he do? I think um, stealing Lee Mei's lantern is very fun. You're going to find a lot of really neat things you can now do with, with Shijinko. Had to experiment with it because there's a lot of new stuff that will be happening with this. Uh, just a real big change to how he works as a cameo. So it's going to be a lot, of, a lot of time in the lab for those who are who want to learn Shijinko. Yep. Uh, another thing, we uh, just so you know, we are on TikTok. We've been doing TikTok for a while. That's pretty That's pretty, right now pretty big TikTok what they're below. doing so far. We do have an AR filter on TikTok. Um, uh, yeah, TikTok AR filter. QR Yo, where are y'all on, on Facebook, Facebook watching from? Threads. As always, don't forget, I'm trying to find out where everybody's watching filter. from on the uh, channel. What's up, Jamie? Know, Welcome in. Same to all y'all watching across all the realms. Let me know where you're watching from. I'm trying to learn everybody where you're from. That's I got say. some of y'all. Uh, it'll, it'll tell you what, what your cameo is on there, so you can use that and post it all around. What do you think mine would be? I'm going to say Molina. She's not a cameo. I know. So this, this has a lot of characters in it. Oh, okay. okay. Man, okay. I'd love to see Boone on this. Like, yeah, I'm confused. I'll ask my kid how to do it. Yeah, do that. Okay. Do that. You guys, Florida? Where are you at in Florida? Thing, uh, What's up, Brandon? How are you doing today? In May, at the end of May. Chicago, Chicago South Carolina. Okay, okay. okay. Arkansas. Oh, yeah. Love it. We will all Nebraska. We'll all be there. Yep. It's a really cool event. So if you want to play Mortal Kombat there, make sure you sign up. Virginia? The Breaker website. We're very excited about Rhode Island, Island, San Diego, Always St. Louis. Super yep. cool event. Virginia's and beautiful area. To see you there. Being, I'll be in Virginia in September. Rick, as always, one of the... Got Illinois, Jacksonville? Like, sort of, Gotta love Rick. Gotta I think, love Combo Breaker. To me, the easiest way to sell anyone on Combo Breaker. Do you want to have fun? Well, <laughs> yes. One of the first things you see when you enter the venue, at least last year, was an Ultimate MK3 arcade cabinet. Yes. Like, in the lobby. Right. I just entered and was like... All right, we're good. Yep. So, so if you want to go to that, please do. It's a great time. We'd love to it's see. It's like you they're there. trying to make me um, go. I think we should probably like hop on to what we what we're here for. Ermac. Ermac. 
Now, Ermac, Why does the dude on the far left look completely different today? Do. Somebody uh, help me. I'm struggling with that. Is he not wearing glasses or something or a hat? Have your, the projectiles you're sort of used to. He still usually wears a hat. The stuff you remember, your lifts think. you saw in the yep. trailer, obviously. But he's more of a rushdown character, and it's not always low and high. He's Arizona, Ohio? He What's up, Nicholas? A series of really cancels he can use to keep the pressure going. So you're going to be doing cancels? We'll see what we can do. Yo, I don't know I what the cat is locked in on, but Taki is locked in on something yeah, outside. Done. Thank you. And that, and we'll see if that translates to now. Right. Uh, but yeah, you know, so you can do, you know, different sort of cancels and into hit confirm, maybe sneak some throws in there. He's a, uh, he plays a little differently than some of the past Ermax, but those who've played Ermax before, everything you've always loved, he has for you. Yeah, I, I do think he has pretty much all of the classic movie you expect, the push, the lift, the teleport, but a lot of them visually look different and have some neat functionality, like little- Nice, Jay. Now after this, we're gonna be taking a look at really Ermac and all the different I mean, iterations Ermac that we've is seen. That he is, his combo freedom is pretty awesome. Yeah, definitely. There's a lot Ooh, of nice, different stuff you can do combo-wise and way to get into combos with Ermac, which is gonna make people pretty excited. But I also don't think he's gonna be that hard to play. I think there's gonna be a lot of options mm -hmm. And I think it'll require a little bit of execution, but nothing too crazy. Yeah, I never find a lot of analysis paralysis while I'm playing. They're going to make him like I, Peacemaker, I, where he's I just got super overpowered shot. moves, and he can just do like all there, these amazing things super I'm easy. To do what I will. Like, I think a lot of different levels of player will enjoy the So simple, but with depth. Yeah. Okay. I feel like that's, I honestly feel like that's been a lot of our characters. It is. Yeah. There, yeah. There's a lot of characters like... You can just get the ground running and do the. I'd like to see Ed Boone come on these though, longer, like one time. Or you can dig in deeper and play longer and really. Who do you want to see the, come back, Anthony? The real deep stuff on the camera. What's up, Matt? The meat, yes. Meat. So now that we've talked about Ermac. We'll we, see how he plays. Here, here we, we go. go. What they do with All him? Right here we are, Ermac, with the mask. With the mask. Yeah. The mask. With the mask, which was everybody had to beg for, yeah. but they Black gave it to mask. him. Uh, and he has some of his gear is some oh, of the coolest it's gnarly yeah. oh kintaro hell yeah what's up Helmet spencer kyle wear. welcome in brother exclusively which i will not talk anything more about johnny i'd say probably uh, javon it's awesome He's i i love the like weird marionette way so he, he does kind of semi float I think like, our design team and our animators have really nailed the uh kind of so terry welcome in on the purple side crest line welcome in uh, yeah for his, uh cool throw so that's his grab, throw, forward grab. And then just very, very that's his back well. grab. Um, yeah, so let's talk about, uh, about Ermac. One of his main strings that people are really going to enjoy. One of my favorites, kind of old school. Uh, one of those strings that ends in a grab at the end. Mm -hmm. Very reminiscent What's of up, like Luca? the Welcome ultimate in. MK3 kind of lift, except he throws him over, but that kind of hand right. gesture reminds me of it, which is a cool. And probably easier to do. Yeah. <laughs> and if you want to, you don't have you can just you don't have to do the ending and it's the knockdown. Mm -hmm. So he's got mix ups. Um so this, why wouldn't you lift? Yeah, because yeah, it's, it's, it's too cool. cool. Like yeah. boom. Do you lift, bro? Remember <laughs> that? Uh this is one of his main strings too that I love using. Two one two. Mm -hmm. Pop up. Yep. Okay, that's a good pop up. That's gonna be really, really two fun to use. Goes into pop. And you can combo after that if you want to. See, he's got a couple uh, demons that he summons too. These are, I'm assuming, spirits like, that are inside of Ermac. One of, one of those moves people really enjoy because it takes a lot of the onus off of you. You, you're, it's, it's a pop up. And combo. this is as loud as it goes. That's their podcast. And I think you'll see that he has a lot of really cool air combos and air enders and stuff he like that. He has some. He has a, some of the most air moves in the game, I would say. Uh, one of the most air, air moves in the uh, game. Oh, there we are. There we are. Uh, this move. He, That's uh, a good move. Kicks you and then just a burst of souls. And, and it, you know, for Yo, what's up, Terry? Does, Welcome in on red, homie. Damage. Uh, this can be canceled out with some stuff that we will show later, so we're going to hold off on that a little bit. You're working up to it. We're going to work up to All it. All right. Mm -hmm. um, his Torch 4 is really neat. Taki's just so locked in on something outside. Torch 4 3 is just, it knocks them away. This is another move that, on the outset, looks just like a kind of a jumping knee. Mm -hmm. Right. A lot more is going to come from that later. We will get back to that as yeah, well. Yeah, you'll notice he's he's airborne, which yes. we'll talk about. Keep that in mind, yes. It, it I'm curious in. what they show on Mabato, because he hasn't and been seen in forever. Air, you're, what you're stating, Ermac's he is airborne. It's been 18 yes. years um, for Mabato. 4 two, two. No if I'm not mistaken. So, like we said earlier, there's not a lot of overhead lows with Ermac. This is one thing you kind of throw out and fish 
and you know knock them down, knock them away, or just throw okay. the head out and cancel into a special. It's also worth considering. Yo, what's up, Billy? How you feeling today, well. boss? The cameo system means Absolutely. there are characters like Kung Lao and Frost that have good lives. Absolutely. Um, but this is a great one to start out there. Has, has a good amount of range. Yeah. Good amount of range. Uh, back to four. Back to four. It's got another cool pop-up. Sort of just trapping bounce. Mm -hmm. And it can also, it can be special canceled as well. You can pop up, you can use that as a um, pop-up into like a Sonya cameo. Um, that's I think full move and knocks you fully away. Chameleon cameo. And then you can do like a lift off. Mm -hmm. uh, and more stuff too, obviously. But that's just where you are there. Uh, this move is a ton of fun. This is just his back. Is it's he? It's kind of like a. a get I don't know what move. it is, Patrick. Uh, just sends you full back. A, uh, a specter comes out and knocks you backwards. Uh, gives you a little distance when you when you need it. With right. Him. It seems like he does do a lot of things to get distance as well. He does, and he has a lot. Of, he has a couple of things. He's got a push move range mm -hmm. as well. Uh, let's talk about some special moves. As we've seen earlier, we got the just the classic lift. Yep, that big skeletal. Yeah, maybe. Jado, it is. Now you can also meter burn that for to trap him. Oh. And do air combos or whatever, whatever you want to do. Yeah, I like the air combo, so I'm probably going to be loving Ermac. A lot of fun. That looks I fun. Guess. A lot of stuff you can do with that. Uh, he's got a push. Yep. And has Force a push. Of range. That's, that's, kind of that's pretty right sick. Right? I'm not gonna lie. I'm a fan of that. I wanted to start playing him just for that little monster guy. Which I'm wondering, he's exactly. And you know, they have to be really safe because there's a good amount of distance. He's obviously got a soul uh, of a demon or something in it. Oh, congratulations, Samantha. I hope it's I hope it's awesome. radar menu. You can use that to beat projectiles, long range normals. You could like whip punch James? with it. Right. And that's, that's full. I just did pretty much max distance right there. Mm -hmm. And that's. You got some good range. That's a good range. He's got, got an enhanced range. stance, uh, like a second a good, uh, stance that I want to check out. Right. This teleport is very interesting. So, see, I'm starting on the ground. Mm -hmm. I teleport. I end on the ground. Yeah, I'm still on the ground there. I wish I, I could also, artificially enhance the loudness. Go up. So I can go on the ground or the it's air. Is, it's it's maximum that. loud. So I can go up. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Or I can do it from the air. You go up. Mm -hmm. You can do it to the air, go back down. Wow. So like any up, down, you can mix and match. Them. Mind blown right now. One thing that's fun to do too, is you can actually kind of go up here with it and you're right in their face. Right. And oh, that's you neat. To you. So you can Bob drop it and then. <laughs> so that's that's a lot of fun too. Um, He's coming down. You want Bob Ross gonna back on, bud? It's really going to add to their mental stack when you have multiple options coming up. They're going to have to look for the teleport and then also guess how you're going to teleport yeah. back in. Right. Um, big thing, uh, down back two is, oh, that's not that. Oh. Did it wrong. Oh. Hover. Okay. So hover does so, a few things. You're hovering. You can cancel it early, that sort of thing. If you meter burn okay. it, it's quicker. Nope. He looks good. And we'll explain that in a second. He's got a lot of options. Knee we talked about. Yes, I do. Tell me about that knee. So you can cancel. Jessup, cool. can you find the description with, and with, understand with, with, with what it is, homie? That'd be amazing. So what do you think it is? Pressure. So I can do that. Maybe I come down and I Like, oh. Jessup, Locked all your answers so are in the, air, in the description, my friend. Levitate, which opens up a lot of things. Like this it's string it's one, it's two, three. Down. It's four words, bro. Oh. I missed it. Hold on, sorry. Oh, welcome so in, buddy. It's good to see you. Yeah, he does. Okay, Landon. Right. Nice. Into a, into a full combo. Got okay. it in less than three tries. Right. You're really just a normal person. I'm just okay, he's a little pretty good. <laughs> What's up, and Nick? Welcome in. If I miss anybody's cool. comment, so man, I apologize. Always, you know, I love that kind of UMK3. Let me pull up my chat over here so I can watch it over here. start putting this pressure on, like, where does it go, right? And that's going to be really fun for a lot of people to play with. I've really enjoyed it. So Let's sometimes go. when I'm like alone in my apartment, so he looks I pretty do good. That pose, and that's no, that's not weird, right? That's Everyone does that, right? Uh, absolutely yeah. normal. Okay. Let's talk about some new stuff to Mortal Kombat One's Ermac. Uh, so off, yeah, that's what I was waiting for. What is the new stuff we okay. haven't seen? Where he comes out of spirit, touches him. This is it right here. Shield on him. Right. While that is active, and it lasts five, six seconds, there it went away. Your health bar is now your meat. So you are getting meter taken off instead of health, mm -hmm. right? So a very clear scenario would be you're about to lose. Alexander, what's up, buddy? I don't, I don't understand what you mean. Like what do you, you mean by that? Boss. You know, let's say you're way ahead and the time's running out. 
turn it on. They, they're chipping right. away at your meter right. while your health bar is safe. The cool thing about this, too, is you can turn it off whenever you want to. So if someone's doing a combo to you, you can take half that combo, turn it off. Like, there's a lot of different, like, mind games you can play with it. Some fun stuff that way. Okay. Well, also, that's kind of cool. demon lady looks really cool. She does. Uh, another move that's new is Spirit Punch. So he has this punch where he charges it up. Oh, okay. I thought he said spear punch. Spirits. Now it has a bunch of levels. You can do it just real quick. Just knock them away. Hold it down. Uh. Gives you a crumple state. Ooh. And then it's time. You know? Right. That was yeah. messing with the now tablet. the other thing. This move can be canceled out. Mm -hmm. So you can turn it on. I can back out. That's good. Turn it on. Back forward. You can that floatiness looks like it's going to make him a little bit harder to deal I'm, with. Sorry to say, not great at that, but you can you can continue pressure like we were talking about earlier. Um, super cool move. Another move he has is that's new. Is yeah, it is Samantha. Souls move where he slides on the ground and that screen didn't up. flicker at all for y'all, did it? Also can be canceled. So once you hit, you can double dash forward and continue a combo. So I can be like. Okay. Like that's that. pretty. That's okay. I like that. Got that's it. pretty swaggy. And so that it just always like constant pressure with Ermac. You're continuing moving forward. I don't know what that thing is on the them, teleporting around. Yeah, that's just what like I was saying. Earlier, that's what I was thinking. It's gonna make the foot. The yes. There's a, so much. It's like a lot of our characters. It's gonna make the footing like while you're fighting him. That could happen. At By the way, are there not a lot of barefoot characters in Mortal Kombat One? I don't remember seeing a lot of toes in this game. Routes. Very cool. Uh, one of my favorite moves he has is this. He's got... Wow, you can see Ermac's toes. This is his only quote-unquote projectile. As you can see, it runs across the ground. You can only he do doesn't it. have his uh, force um, ball? If you use meter, it costs two bars of meter. He doesn't have his energy ball? This, and it'll send out these hands. That's so cool. Start a they said that's his quote-unquote only again, projectile? Go back to the knee. The thing that has sort of been the, the thesis of the story is you can do it from knee. What's up, Choppy? Good to see you, my friend. Welcome in. Ermax looking crazy, man. This is a this is a big combat cast for them. Very cool. Um, that's kind of a spin-off of his old uh, Mortal Kombat deception move. Lots of cool stuff he can do. Players who've played him before will get a lot of the same feeling. But there's a there's a depth to him with these okay. cancels, with these these air shenanigans we'll call them mm -hmm. that you can do. That's actually that probably seems like a fair fight that he all those these ghost helpers. Yeah, right. That doesn't seem fair. Right, like it's Mortal Kombat and ghosts are inherently they've left this mortal coil. They sure have, uh, and yeah, he, he's got plenty of health. Yeah. Um, which is awesome. I guess they're it's all sandals. part of him, so it's fair. He is many. It, it I is mean, they're just kind of like you know, we should bland, definitely but... show his. Uh, they love they love the, the the off no they love the i just never noticed it they love the the mismatched sides like i noticed that everything is mismatched like look at ermac like like what i mean is is like this jack is mismatched this side's different from this side and the same thing with all their character designs they're always different from one side to the other it's like completely a couple things I messed up on it. You get nervous when you're doing it. You're human. I think, and you're you. Yeah. And he must have left the hat behind because you yeah, could tell yeah. he was wearing it I a minute ago. Mac, definitely. I mean, I've always loved the character. And he I, was your main. Yeah. He was Are we my, getting a look at Movado today too? Main back in the game, so that's super fun for me. Uh, also, though, I super love Movado. Like I've really been enjoying mm -hmm. what I can do with Ermac and Movado. Not that you know, every character works with everybody. If you right. Figure it out. Yeah. But I've we really get into Movado. Team up. It's a little so, duo of yours. A little duo of mine. So that's duo. what I'll be playing through uh, definitely in the next season. I'm excited to see him back. I still don't know what timeline uh, we're in, Jado. Like, like, where are we at in time really in this cool design, I think it's game exactly? Are like we in... Bungie ropes thing or just so unique. 2040? So. Are we um, in cool 1960? I mean, <laughs> it was the 90s. Leather jacket. You can't go wrong with. Long leather jacket. Right. Like, that, was just, that was just cool. So I mean, they are going to show Movado, right? Who didn't have one? <laughs> so let's, let's take a look at uh, Movado. So Vaughn has a bunch of he's he excellent. Movado he returns after um, he since 2006. He's been not seen. He has a way you can, you know, break use. Uh, not since Mortal Kombat Bond Armageddon. Them back, which I will not be showing. It's in the trailer. Mm -hmm. Crazy. I cannot do that. Uh, just a lot of really cool stuff. So let's take a look. One thing he has that's really neat. Uh, he'll just. So what y'all think of Ermac so far? Which will pull you forward, and at the end, you're kind of crumpled and knocked down. Now if they can block that. Is that some red dragon tech right That's there? That's right. It yeah. is. Yeah. So like, you know, boom. That's a low. Created Got by it. the same scientist that built Sue Howe's uh, 
chess players. It sure feels like it, right? They love so throwing some Sue How in here and there, don't they? They absolutely love Sue How here and there. Nice combo ender to add some damage. Yo, what's up, Hitman? Just fling each other into each other. Can you Nomad's touch. Explain that. To that is that is have. a cabal move from MK Deception. I'm so excited to have Mavado in. He stole his hook swords in Deception. He stole Nomad's touch. What a criminal. Yeah, I, I love say it. He's a criminal. I mean, it's so long criminal. They did. Take a little damage. The other person That's so damage. funny that like he keeps taking he moves. Also has, this is really cool. When you knock them down. No, nah, this is the combat cast hit, man. You can slide oh. out with him at low. And people are like, what does that do? Now it adds a little damage for one. Mm -hmm. What I enjoy it for is it stops wakeups. Oh. oh. So they have to, they just have to hold that. Yep. Um, and that's what I've been, that's sort of what I've been sort of theory crafting its use as. Um, super. This cool. is a live reveal hit, um, man. One, the, the two other moves he has, like remember these memes. Ermac's looking like a really beast. Good. If they're in the air, he can fly back towards them and knock them back towards the you. Yo, he's actually looking like he's gonna be kind of crazy. Combo continuation. He can also do it from the sky. I was gonna ask. Different input, which I like showing it like this. I have no idea, Patrick. And that is neat because normally you cannot combo after an uppercut. Some characters can. Right. Uh, Sonya's, I believe, can. I hope so. Scorpions, I believe, can. Uh, this is a new one you can do it on. I it's hope he actually, is, Hitman. I slid slid under, under, <laughs> I'm out. It's pretty. It's pretty <laughs> Yo, Grimzilla Gaming with the hundo bits, adding to the clock. Thank you, let me load up the sprinkler. Thank you for the bits! I appreciate that very, very much, yo. Thank you so much for the support. I'll give you a big thank you screen, and we'll go through the star senders when we get done, too. We're gonna be doing an Ermac showcase when this live's over. Well, I think one thing that'd be cool is he could help extend your combos if you're a character that's not combo-focused. Right. Or if you are like Ermac and you have a lot of options, you can even go. So off down. they didn't go over so Scorpion's really new moves yet, did they? System. The ability to kind mm -hmm. of, you know, triple, quadruple down or fill in Ball gaps that you might have. So like this is the, I mean this basic combo I've been working on at my desk. We'll see if I can pull it off. I got faith in it. Ooh. There you go, Cal. Cal oh, was no, messing with the little good. tablet and screwed it up. So close. If you like, I should try it one more time. Absolutely. That looks fancy. All right, hold that. Uh, well, I, that was it. That was it. Just want to see me do a sprinkler, Andy. I thought that was you, man. Thank you very, very much, man. Make sure I give you the follow. Thank you. The bits, the bits, the bits. The bits are automated uh, to the timer. You drop bits, it just okay. automatically right. extends the guy. timer. There he is. Third time's a charm. What do you call that combo? Facebook. I got to manually it. Nice. Okay. So that, in a nutshell, in a nutshell, is Bavada. Yeah. I think okay. Can, I think, um, now we're gonna be checking out Ermac in Mortal Kombat Trilogy after this, and then Mortal Kombat, Kombat, uh, Mortal like Kombat really Ultimate cool Mortal Kombat Deception Ermac. Cameos are. Oh, you look at Mavado too, if you like. It's, it's really What's up, Kirk? The meta shift and evolve as people figure them out. And a wide variety across them all of what right. they can do. And yes. Thank you again, though, uh, Andy. I appreciate Ermac, you, yeah. Mavado, some changes coming to the game. We're very excited. You did really good. Yeah. Th You're tired. Your thumbs tired at all? It's always nerve wracking doing it because we have so many amazing players who are watching who want the skinny oh and yeah like, now I don't forget to check our green I, shield I, I too for gifted sub whether like, you're on oh, facebook it, cool. right. check yeah. over on twitch too like for gifted subs really we had some go yeah. out the other day as well i think this was your best demonstration yet thank you thank you i just it helps when you really like the character too because i really dug in and like tried to learn this stuff um so cool so derek i believe before we sign off the show is fatal blow yet i don't think so yeah. The most important part. Is this of birthday shout outs? Part. All right. I will say after birthday shout outs real quick, after the closing, there is a fight that QA did again. Yeah. Which is so we'll get to see awesome. them in the full fight on this. And uh, some fun. something special. Some, it, it's going to get brutal. Ah! That's the MKX right. figure from Sorry, your last name. the collector's yeah, edition. Or first name, honestly. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. This, yeah, yeah, yeah. So happy birthday to That's the bookend Lopez, from MK9. Frederico. Four squares. We're going with that one. Uh, Daniel Hurd, Graham Shear, Michael Salerno. Yeah, they did uh, show it. That's Jerome right. Jerome Burrell, Pav. Happy birthday, Pav. And Sacco, Rohan Williams, Freddie Palma, James Palermo. I'm sorry, Palermo. James. Palermo. Thanks, bud. Uh, Tony Smith, uh, Shaji. Freddie, I thought Nick Freddie had Niebling, one. Niebling, Lauren Seacrest. Robert Lathan, Will Jackson, Ian Boyle, 
Justin Berkeley were almost there. Uh, Mark Gorski, Bill B Bussing, we'll go with that. Uh, Sean Gallagher, and our favorite, Warren Wilkes. Oh, Happy yeah. Happy birthday, there Warren Wilkes. Boss. Awesome. Well, that is the combat cast for today. So, Before Mark? Before we go, I mean, we're going to go now. Yeah, yeah. Show All right, here's the full on uh, match. QA put together uh, that I think is pretty awesome. So, this is so QA. This should be time. high level Ermac gameplay with Movado. I'm guessing they're gonna probably put him up against uh Sundo. Did we not get did we not get shown uh, they said Scorpion's got new moves, but did they show him? So this is to showcase Reptile's new moves on this. Like he's got he can cancel out of the sky drop now, which is bonkers. That's his move for full screen projectile. Hey, they forgot about your birthday. Happy you birthday from the lock I hope you had a beautiful birthday yesterday. I'm sorry that this guy was like, I didn't forget about your birthday. They didn't show Scorpion's moves? Yeah. Damn, that's gonna be wild, man. They just made him insane. Now you can cancel out of that in anywhere. They gave him a full screen for that time. What's up, Alexander? Hang in there, buddy. You say you saw Nick in there earlier? So, damn, we got 556 damage off of that. Okay, that's not bad. That's fatal, though. Wow, that's fast as hell. Turn this down just a little bit. Yo, that, that projectile is ultra fast. But it is, uh... And he can cancel out of that sky drop now, which is wild. What an escape. So, that was Reptile's only two new moves. He's got that new... Which is good that he's got the force ball back. Um, I'm surprised that Ermac doesn't have a projectile as far as his his little green energy. Uh, that's unique. What's up, Josh? Welcome to the stream. I like that demon thing right there. Yo, they showed us a brutality instead of a fatal. They don't usually do that. <clears throat> Thank you for watching. Well, thank you for making the game. Ladies and gentlemen, let me know what you thought of that combat cast right there. Let me see if I can rewind that a little bit. Brutality. That was actually kind of sick. He looks really good. He looks really good. Hey man, thanks NRS. That looks fun as hell. A lot of positive changes. Now just buff Ashra and we'll call it square, all right? Like no, like no, for, for real. Ashra needs just like one or two things. Like I feel like one or two things Ashra just needs. So let me know what you think of the combat cast. Let me know what you think of the uh well, what does it look like to you? Now we're going to be booting up Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3 and we're going to start into some uh Ermac towers. So let me go down here. Let me close this and let's get into the stream, shall we? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome into the show. Greetings and hello. Give me one second to make all the proper changes <laughs> and adjustments that we need to make to get directed over to this. So, like the invisible cancel more? Uh, let me turn this down. Turn this on for you. There we go. That's better and give you a little game so you can see it there we go we should be good we should be good shout out to all you legends on the stream justin chris steven otis man big shout out to mr chad who is holding on the con i believe i gotta make an adjustment on that all right legends let's go ahead and jump into this what do i think i think he looks good 
Looks good. Uh, we didn't get into the, the uh, new mechanic in the game, did they? The new uh, push mechanic? They didn't see anything about the new push block. So we're going to take a look at Ermac in the previous games, Legends. Welcome into the stream. Now, we got to give some thank yous out here. Damari, and if you're in the room right now, I'm just saying collector to pick up those 50 stars as soon as my star screens begin to work. Welcome into Hitman, Jessup, Adrian, DOA, Hitman, Mark. Good to see you. Scorpion's your favorite character? He's a good character, my friend. So this is the first round that we saw Ermac in his classic form. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Now this, I did not have the mid-air projectile on, so... Now this game is in the link tree. If you go ahead and look in the four squares in the chat, you will see the link tree in there, and that's where you'll be able to find the download link for this game. Well, that sounds good, Mark. You gotta come play with us Mortal Kombat 11 or Mortal Kombat 1 one of these days, homie. Now we're gonna be playing Ultimate Mortal Kombat Deception after this. So Ultimate Mortal Kombat Deception by Ermacker. Classic. That's probably why they showed that. Flawless victory. Cyrax? Oh, Alexander Cyrax is a great character. All right, real quick. Fujin music going out to Damarian. Thank you very much for the stars at the beginning of the stream. I do appreciate that. This is going out to Ebony, who did come in from work. Thank you very much. And then this is going out to Grimzilla Gaming, hitting us with the bits over on the Twitch. Thank you so very much for the love and support. Now that we're here, what are y'all getting into for the afternoon? Welcome into the stream today. Don't forget to drop a like and a share out there. Let them know what we're doing over here on Headlock Gaming today. The Kitty co-host was, uh... It's a bunch of new moves that they added to it. He's a nightmare, man. Jade is an absolute nightmare. Especially on this, Cyrax. Oh, yeah, I knew what you meant, buddy. It's that, it's that, that backwards boomerang. You can't ever beat it. We've already lost too much health. Like, we're gonna die. Yeah, you lose too much health on her. No, he still got it. It's just like he he runs in with crazy stuff now. He's got a bunch of new moves and stuff. I would have to go back and check it. The cat was uh, kind of locked in on something while we were uh, doing that, but so I was kind of having to deal with the cat as we were starting that. But that was it. So we're almost at 100 reactions though, Legends. Thank you very very much. You got to. Damn, she's a beast on this. <laughs> She is a nightmare because she's got that backwards boomerang that can hit you from anywhere, and it does. God, legends. So what are y'all planning on doing for the afternoon? Welcome to the show once again. That was the reveal of Ermac on Mortal Kombat 1, which is coming out tomorrow. The charging him. Terry, thank you for the thousand stars. Double booty and cake. Oh, ain't very nice. Feed the trees, double booty and cake. Very, very nice. Roll that pork rinds. I gotta get those. Quan Chi on the sack. Striker now is called Great Horn Holio Hol Hol Stars. Thank you, homie Possible Run. Feed the trees, shedding tree. Double booty peach and cake birthday cake. Wish this game was on PS5. It would be awesome. Yes, Mortal Kombat 1 is on PS5, though. And I would like to play with each and every one of you on the stream one of these days. Yo, thank you for the love on the stream. No uh, mention of uh, stage fatalities yet. No mention of stage fatalities yet. Yo, this is going out to you, my guy. Thank you very, very much for the love and support on the show. This is also Quan Chi on the saxophone, which is a good star screen. Legends, as you're coming into the stream, this is a good opportunity once again to let me know where you are watching from because I am trying to remember where all you are watching from. I know, Michael, where are you at in the world? Yo, and Terry, thank you. Where is the great Cornholio? He is right here. 
I think that was the great Cornholio screen. What's up, Jonathan? Welcome into the show. Greetings and hello. Let me find the other booty and cake screen. This is the other one that I have. This is the showcase. Sorry. It's my favorite cameo right there. What do y'all think of Reptile? Terry, again, thank you, homie. What do you think of Reptile now being able to... They really buffed him up a ton. Yo, this game is cooking today. Let me focus on this. Let me focus on this. Yeah, David, we're checking out the combat cast today. Today was the combat cast reveal of Ermac in Mortal Kombat 1 coming out tomorrow. So we jumped on early today to check that out. It was posted in our group and it was posted in the supporter group as well. There we go. Yep. You got Mortal Kombat 1 on PS5? Yo, Jonathan, a beautiful game around you. What do you play with? I always wanted this to be a stage fatality. We could actually knock them off the off the back. Like you could do that in Mortal Kombat versus DC Universe. You can actually throw your opponent right through the ledge and they will actually fly through it. And uh, what's up, Quan? Good to see you on the show. Greetings, hello. You could actually throw him off, and uh, that was actually not the worst game, I didn't think, at the time. I've grown to dislike it more over time. But initially, back in the day, uh... there we go. Quan Chi, thank you very, very kindly. I appreciate you, my guy. 82 degrees in Woodbridge? That's warm. That is hot. Yo, this is going out to you, my friend. I still haven't discovered this game, which we are still looking for. Some smoke action? Oh, I'm going to be doing a look at, at Ermac today since we were doing the Ermac reveal on the combat cast. Oh, you main smoke. Hellboy. You ever think of like coming into a stream and like, I don't know, like saying what's up or I don't know, reading a description. I ain't trying to be rude or anything. I'm just trying to help you out like in life in general. Why am I on early? Read the description. I don't know. I'm not even gonna answer it, dude. What's up, Elboy? It's good to see you too, buddy. Welcome into the stream. I'm not trying to be rude, man, but damn, bro. Like, people, like, I just... Fight. All right. We were doing the combat cast for Ermac, buddy, but that's why I put that in the uh, description, homie. In Kung Lao. Nice. Did you get that classic skin? There we go. No, the combat cast was on today, so I put in the description we were gonna be on for the combat cast to reveal it and then do an Ermac breakdown for the uh, reveal of Ermac. But, so that's why we're on early today. Ermac looks good. They did add a bunch of stuff to Mortal Kombat 1. I don't know if that's the, uh, that force thing is gonna be related to just, uh, I don't know if it's going to be just exclusively for Motara or for uh, Mavado or what, but. Work. Thank you, Jay. All right, this is one of the toughest characters in this game, so you kind of got to watch out for this. Let's see. Shit. Ermac does look cool. He just, I don't know why he doesn't have this. Uh, he doesn't have his force ball anymore. Grinding MK1. Today's the last day to get the stuff done. If you want to level up to God, he does not have this in Mortal Kombat 1. I don't know why. Best fighting game ever made. It's an interesting time for Mortal Kombat with what they're doing and where things are going. Like, I'm curious to see what the future holds. Uh, what I mean is I'm curious to see what the next Mortal Kombat... Uh, you're good, David. Uh, 
Riker's tough. I'm curious to see if they stick with it, if they stick to their guns for the next game. What I mean by that is if they stick to their guns and they stay with this timeline. Which I guess they're, they're gonna have to now. I, like, who's gonna become Noob Cybot? Who's gonna become the new... Who's gonna die to become Noob Cybot? I saw an interesting theory. What if, uh, what if... So, Sub-Zero killed his father in Mortal Kombat 1. Like, what if he just came back? Yo, this dude is cooked. What if he came back as the uh, noob cybot? We ain't getting this gap. If he... If, if we got to see a brand new character... Damn, man, he is so tough on this game. If we got to see a new character be noob cybot, I think that'd be very unexpected. But that would leave Hanzo Asashi as nobody. Because currently Hanzo Asashi is just a child. So that's why I think Scorpion has to die at some point. I think our current Scorpion has to die. I just think he has to. And then I think Hanzo Hisashi is going to be turned into the new... Hanzo Hisashi has to become somebody. Damn, this dude's insane. If Hanzo Hisashi doesn't become somebody, then he's just going to be... Oh, I, I remember, I remember. I do have a Sega CD emulator, but I can't play Sega CD Mortal Kombat because Sega CD Mortal Kombat is, uh... It just gets copyright claims, so I can't do it. That's the uh, only reason. But I would love to do it. I would love to absolutely get into that more. But unfortunately, I just can't because I it gets copyright claimed like a son of a bitch. Yo, what's up, Level? Welcome into the stream, Level. Thank you very much. Appreciate you being here. Welcome into the show. I am all out of the hot beans right now, so if any of those punishments will have to be uh, translated into gross bean punishments. He did not have this move, which is odd that he did not keep his uh, force ball. So he's got a floor mechanic that he hits. And uh, you saw Reptile's new moves? I don't think he, I mean, I could have gone for that. He, hey, thank you, Level, for being here. I don't think that he uh, needed the cancel for his one move but he looks good it's the uh i wouldn't have given him the stuff that he, I, that's i see what they did but it just makes me feel like man there's some characters getting left behind like uh Fight. like there's some characters just getting so left behind like you got a full screen projectile you got all these mobility uh options going on like you got carried like Melina can't even throw a full screen projectile. Melina fans are struggling right now. I do like fighting Melina on Combat League though. I really do like fighting Melina on Combat League though. Cabal is the scariest fighter. I'm surprised Cabal has not come into the game. Uh, I'm surprised he got left aside on this. Oh, yeah, I keep turning it off, Luko, because when we go to bonuses, I'm going to be done with this tower in a minute. We're going to be on to uh, PlayStation 2 anyway. Did you miss much in the combat cast? Uh, they went over some new stuff with Shijenko. They went over the stuff with Movado, and they revealed Ermac and some fun new mechanics. It looks like it's going to be pretty good. He drops tomorrow at 11 a.m. Uh, Eastern, I think. If it's... Uh, This is PlayStation 1 version? No, 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 Trufiano. This is an enhanced, uh, this is a Mugen fan version that has uh, some new stage fatalities. Like you couldn't do the brutality and the uppercut and the stage fatality. And that added stage fatality was a little different too. There we go. He looks good. I'm a, like I said, like they like giving their characters the, uh, the uh, imbalanced, uh, 
I, I'm looking forward to, to, to damn. Mm. I knew he's gonna hit that. What's up, Lovell? Good to see you. Good. Thank you for coming in. Welcome, man. We were doing the combat cast, my friend. I go with that. What's up, Austin? Welcome in, bro. Stop with that. Kano's a beast on these games. See how he started to fall through the floor on that a little bit? He gets absolutely beastly. Next like on the stream is the 100th like on the stream. He's also one of your... Jeez, man. You can't ever get out of this. Mm -hmm. He's a mess on these games. No, it doesn't have it. You don't have infinite run on these. You can never jump him either. Like, you'll get smacked if you try to jump. Top three? Mm, I gotta think about that. Cyber Smoke is your favorite? All right. Yeah, he's a good character. Movado, I'm surprised to see get love on the franchise. Damn, dude, he's running out before the match started. God, he is a fucking nightmare. He can't do anything. He's too fast. I went to go hit him and he, yo, what's up? We have true, true Fiano. Welcome in. Jeez. He blocks everything you do too. So you have to just go hard as hell. Cyber ninjas. I mean, he's already in the game. I don't know why they haven't added him. Fuck's sakes. They've already add, added him. Um, to the uh he's in the story mode you can play cyber smoke in the story mode already this is just overwhelming like fucking hard the game is like choking like fighting him of course he can go that full screen oh hell no nah, he didn't do that shit <laughs> Yo, he is way too busted on these mutants. Kano's almost like a smoke on these games. Favorite uh, all-time top three? What do you mean? Game characters? What are you talking about? Hours on Janet Cage? What do you mean? How many hours have I played Janet? I haven't played Janet that much since she came out. I played her a little bit. She's great for damage and all that, but... I... I, I've just never been a big cage... Like, I wasn't into Cassie Cage. I wasn't a big Johnny Cage. I wasn't, like, all the... I, I like the more mystical characters, like Ermac, the sorcerers, the deities, the stuff like that, you know? Like, if that's what you meant. No, it doesn't have the maximum run sheet, though. Like, I wasn't huge on, like, Striker and all that, or Aaron Black, you know, like, all that stuff. Uh... After that, yeah, Thomas, yeah, Kitty's chilling. Go, go. Nope. Damn, she is a. F Look at this nut. See, that's what I mean. Like, when you play these. Oh my god. It's so overwhelming. Like, when you. Like, when you throw somebody on the ground with. with like, you saw Sonya do there. Like, she's chucking out fireballs while you're laying on the floor. I wish there was a setting you could use or turn on on Mugen where the human could play like that because you are incapable of doing that. And I wish you could... That mechanic looks kind of fun to be able to just go off the rails haywire. And they don't let you do that. Like, you're at... See, like, that's what I mean. Like, she's able to have it no cooldown. Top three favorite games? Oh, Legend of Zelda, Mortal Kombat, and Resident Evil. Yeah, that's that's my three. 
Yo, welcome into the stream. As you come in, don't forget to smash that thumbs up, share with a friend, let them know what we're doing over here at Headlock Gaming. We're on a little bit early today. We checked out the Ermac Combat cast. Now we're checking out some Ermac and Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3. Then we're going to be going to Ermac and Ultimate Mortal Kombat Deception. And then we're going to be checking out... He was also in Mortal Kombat 9 and in Mortal Kombat X. Wins. Yeah, Thomas, Kitty's chilling down here. Uh, Cat's pushing buttons on the TV. So I'm going to have to fix that. Round two. I think Cat turned off the internet on that. Y'all doing, doing anything out there for the day? You got any snacks or anything? Stop with that. This AI is fucking cooked today. Good lord. There we go. That's a good little three right there. Sure, just robbed me of my last hit of the combo. Like, that was just ridiculous. So my last hit of the combo dropped right there. Like, in the middle of the combo. Ermac looks good. Don't forget, if you change your uh, clock back on your PlayStation, you can play with Ermac today. I'm just joking. That doesn't work. But do like to drop that once in a while as a joke. Round one, fight. So what are y'all legends getting into today? Big shout out to you coming in. We did check out some Ermac today in the combat cast. Yo, if you are in the Facebook chat right now, once again, make sure you th smash that thumbs up button. I appreciate you in here. Shout out to my friends watching. Let's get it. Let's go. Y'all got any big plans for the day today? Round two, fight. Go, 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 go. Technically, this is our Mortal Kombat Mortal Monday show. On top of that. Go back. PB and J? Ooh, that sounds good. Bring that back. Very, very nice. Let's go. Now, if anybody does exclamation point bean me, like I said, I have to do the uh, nasty beans today. I do not have the fire beans right now. I don't know what that audio was. But... Heard something over here. So we're checking out Ermac and the different uh, versions of the game that we have. Welcome into the stream once again. Some peppermint lifesaver candies to fight the secession of quitting smoking. Well, congratulations. What's up, Chris? Good to see you, bro. Welcome into the stream. Thank you for coming in and saying hi. What's up, brother? Appreciate that, legend. Appreciate you tuning in with me, homie. Yep, yep, yep. Now we got to go up against old... Uh, let's see. Oh, nice, Austin. So this is Jump Kick City. I hope the deliveries are going good, Chris. Yo, what are you legends on YouTube getting into over on Kick and Twitch? This is basically Jump Kick City on them. You can jump over that. Yo, Quan Chi again. Thank you for those 100 stars, my friend. Thank you for everybody that's dropped a like on the stream. Again, Terry, thank you for the 1,000 stars. And thank you to Grimzilla for those bits. Yeah, that seemed to stutter the game out a bit. Jump over him. Reversed him. So Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3 is actually... Or Ultimate Mortal Kombat Deception is actually uh, online playable on the PS2 as well. See how this goes. So this is the first iteration of Ermac that was in the uh, series. So he had the classic telekinesis. He had the force ball, which he does not have in the new update, which is interesting. Stay back. Excellent. Yo, congratulations for, uh, that's very, very nice, Austin. Happy early birthday on that, my guy. What's up with that? All right. And get that, hold that back. 
So I don't remember what his ending was in the first one. Alright, let's go. So, after this, now we're going to be going to Ultimate Mortal Kombat Deception, which has got Ermac in it as well. Ultimate Mortal Kombat Deception was an amazing game that had an amazing character in it amazing characters in it but Ermacker has added a bunch of new characters to the game and he has added a awesome roster to it so we can go ahead and play with that when is New York Yankees oh that's fantastic brother I've been hiding since first Mortal Kombat neither the earth nor I will recognize the elusive ninja oh, okay he uses the victory to prove his existence well, there's nothing better to do than prove your existence. I mean, so now, oh wait, there's more to it. Okay. Let me go ahead and get this set up as I'm switching over. This should be pretty seamless if I do this right. We're warning you will return as an unstoppable fourth in the force in the fourth Mortal Kombat. Yeah, he actually didn't, so. Turns out that never happened. So this is Ultimate Mortal Kombat Deception. Let me know if you have any audio issues as we make the transition over. Uh, yeah, Austin, we uh, go with our VIP supporter streams. We've done 21 different Resident Evil games with our VIP supporters and I'm practicing Resident Evil 4 for y'all too. Also our retro stuff, we'll be doing retro hunting in that soon. So let me know if I make any audio adjustments or need to make any audio adjustments for you legends as we jump into this. This is actually Ultimate Mortal Kombat Deception. So you have a huge new roster added to this game, which includes almost the second half. This runs a little slow because it's on my USB flash drive. These are all new characters added to Mortal Kombat Deception. And so we're going to be playing with Ermac though, because we got to get Ermac in. And shout out to you legends over on Combat Realm as well. What's up, level? Like I said, this is on my USB flash drive, so it does play a little bit slower. And uh, But as I make the adjustment, let me know if y'all need me to change any audio settings for you. We'll see who we play through on this tower. Johnny Cage and Kira. So Johnny Cage was never in Mortal Kombat Deception, but now through this technology, through this update, through Ermacker, we can actually play as him. See how we go. Appreciate you legends hanging out. Thank you for the likes, the shares, the comments, and any star love or subs that come through. Don't forget to click that shield down below. Oh, thank you, Luca. That's why I didn't want to turn the fucking thing on in the first place. Because then I just have one more thing to stop. It's like, I might as well just get rid of it entirely. And now he's got telekinesis in this. Just like that. Sound is great. Excellent. Nope. Yeah, that's why I'm thinking about getting rid of it entirely, man, because it's just constantly somebody's like, turn that on, turn that off, turn that on, turn that off. Like, we're always changing games, so there's not really like a point to keep it. Let me see something. I think. Oh, no, 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 no. What is she doing? Did I break the game? Oh, okay, wait. I was like, what's going on? Broke the game for a moment. So this is the first uh, of the death traps, which for whatever reason, she's not going into. There we go. First fight was always a little weird on Deception. So his fatalities on this, I actually transitioned to his fatality in Mortal Kombat Mugen, which is back down, back down four. And he does have down, back, back down three, which is, uh, what's up, Billy? It's not the, uh, so Johnny Cage was not in Mortal Kombat Deception. So I do want to point that out. It's, this is just this mod, which is a nice little extra touch that they gave us on this. It adds, he's almost done adding an entire second row of uh, characters to Mortal Kombat Deception. And if you want to play this online, you can actually play this online to this day. Pull it back. I think with this... There's a way that you can uh, hold him back and you can actually telekinesis. Shit. I'm trying to remember what's up mark welcome in i'm 
You could do that four, three times on that last poke and then go back into telekinesis and carry him on. Well, that sounds amazing, my guy. I hope you had fun playing that. All right, now, like I've said many times, if you do click that shield down in the chat, which is in the four squares, you will see if you have a gifted sub waiting for you on the stream. Every time I mention that, somebody in the stream finds out they have a gifted sub waiting for them, so always make sure to check that. Back down, back down four, as I remember saying. The fatality? Did that just freeze? Crap, man, are you serious? So that was my fault. That was an old Mortal Kombat Deception glitch. Well, this is an opportunity to check out the modded PlayStation 2. Um... So if you do the fatality too fast on Mortal Kombat Deception, it will glitch the game out. And it also, on Mortal Kombat Deception, if you did do the fatal or the friendship or the or the fatality or the Harakiri too quickly when you played online, it would actually glitch the game out as well. Uh, there we go. So this is the modded PlayStation 2. This is the two terabyte build which comes loaded with games. Uh, this is absolutely a gem. We've given away a couple of these on the channel. And if you just go to open PS2 loader, that's where it boots up the majority of the games and get that done. So once you go into the games, I'm gonna be going to Ultimate Mortal Kombat Deception and that is where you will find the mod version that has all the extra characters on it. Shout out to you legends watching over on YouTube, Kick and Twitch as well. Appreciate you. I see you over on Combat Realm as well. Thank you for watching. OPL is what runs this whole modified system on this. So this is what you got to get into. Appreciate the love and support while we're live. I do appreciate y'all watching with us today. Takes a second to load because it is loading two terabytes of games all the way around. So when you do play this, make sure you don't press buttons too fast. So this is Ultimate Mortal Kombat Deception. I called it the real disc because there is an emulated. Uh, this is for the Star Senders. It's a random draw each month. We have a number between however many days we have that month. This month, there's 30 days. So we draw a number between 1 and 30. And then we're going to go back to whatever number we draw. And we draw from the Star Senders on the stream. If there's... If we land on a 15, we'd be going back to today's stream and we would be looking at, there's four star senders today, Terry, Ebony, Quan Chi, and Damarian. We would be looking at the four star senders and drawing a number between one through four and whoever lands on it is who wins. So once this boots up, you may notice that there is a little, and this is also the same for this Mortal Kombat jacket. You have to be one of the top three star senders in any live stream we do for the Mortal Kombat jacket though. Same rules apply. So there's a little side missing over here because I have to crop this out and or I have to go put this in widescreen. That is, I, I turn on widescreen and I turn on, what's up Lord Colin? I turn on widescreen mode and I turn on progressive scan mode. Puts it into 480p instead of 480i, which actually makes it a lot cleaner. And uh, it doesn't sound like much difference between 480i and 480p, but... Once you get into the technicals of it, as a live streamer, trust me, it's night and day difference. And you'll also see that little gap go, get filled. So I turn on widescreen here in video options. I turn this on. It takes a second to register it because it is changing. There you go. And just like that, everything is changed and it should be back to normal. And we're going to be getting back into Ermac. And then after that, one, I want to check out Ermac in Mortal Kombat 9 because that was one of his premier appearances in the Mortal Kombat franchise. Ermac in MK9 was a whole... or in, Yeah, he was a whole character in that game. MKX, I, I wasn't that huge of a fan of him because he was kind of... I didn't like the floatiness. Now, I'm going to go with his traditional costume. I felt the uh, other one was a little goofy, but... Yo, pure, what's up? Good to see you. Permarandy, welcome in. Okay, Itty Bitty Kitty co-host is now resting comfortably and sleeping well. There we go. 
So the combat pet cast look good. Uh, we get to fight Goro in this tower, Shao Kahn, and Draman. So this is actually pretty cool. This whole tower is characters that are not in Mortal Kombat Deception. They are characters that are just... Uh, some of them reported from Mortal Kombat Deadly Alliance. Some of them reported from Mortal Kombat Armageddon. Let's see what this and also on this game, you had three different stage fatalities on this level, which was pretty freaking wild, even back for those days. We can't get one in Mortal Kombat 1, but we got three on one stage here. Piotr, what's up, buddy? So that's what I was looking for. That's the first stage fatality in this, which is absolutely sickness. Piotr, thank you very, very much for the reactions, my buddy. I see that. If he knocks us down here, we can take it. Yeah, he'd take it down here. I was going to say, if he knocks us down here, I'm going to send him over there. There we go. That's the second stage fatality on this level. We didn't even get a chance to get to the third because the character is... I mean, you can only kill him twice on one level, which is fantastic. Now, if I was to give you Mortal Kombat trivia, does any of my viewers know why or which fight in Mortal Kombat Deception had five rounds? You need to fight Shao Kahn on this game. Shao Kahn was not originally in Mortal Kombat Deception. Now, this was released by Ermacker. What's up, guy? Welcome into the stream. Thank you for coming in and saying hi, my guy. I appreciate that. Uh, let us see. Round one. Fight. Which one was I trying to go for? Okay, so that one can fly into that right there. Yep, Shao Kahn. They were playable in the GameCube port, and then uh, what was Unchained? And then it was, it's a shame that we didn't get, it felt like on Deception, that was actually pretty badass. It felt like on Deception, we didn't get the full version because for whatever reason, it just, uh, I don't know. Like, I guess they didn't have time to give us the, the complete version because they had other plans for Mortal Kombat Deception. Uh, I fully believe. Now, when you have an enemy in the corner, I just had that right there. I was close enough, I'm gonna throw him down. There we go. I used to get that online, no problem. I wonder if that's an online only combo. What's this Harakiri? Okay. My guy throws it up and knocks it down. Here, Mirandy, welcome in. So, if you was to rate the combat cast, and what did you think of Ermac out there today? Ermac looked pretty good, I thought. I'm a little surprised he doesn't have that force ball energy, because I thought that was going to be, uh, I thought that was going to be kind of a staple for him, but, I mean, it is what it is. He's going to join the ranks of Johnny that doesn't have the actual technical full for, uh, a full screen projectile. He's got one that is the ground attack that they showed. Or looks like a damn sub boss in this. Tekken 8. How many of you are still playing on Tekken 8? I haven't heard much going around about Tekken 8 lately. Also, this little spin right here was good. Hold that back. Excellent. Tekken 8's a good game. Tekken 8's a very good game. I just haven't gone through and I haven't played much of it because it's a... Uh... Tekken 8's a, gr it's a good game. I just haven't had a lot of time to get into it. I've been behind the scenes busy as shit. Ermac was a lot of fun on this game. I've never knocked him into the, uh, the meat trap, the meat grinder over here. So I'm going to go over here and check it out. Yo, that's the first time I've seen Goro go into the meat grinder on this game. 
Kitty, you doing good? Your Bob Ross show kind of messed up, Kitty. I don't know what you hit. I think you turned off the internet or something. Oh, you did. The cat turned off the Wi-Fi. So, there we go. So, the cat sometimes starts hitting buttons on the uh, tablet. Anyone here play Diablo 4? That is a good question. I don't myself play Diablo 4, but... Uh, now, this is a new stage that came to this game, too. You may recognize this from Mortal Kombat uh, Deadly Alliance. Stop with that. Play for four days. Stop with that. Liu Kang's actually pretty goaded in this. Oh, damn. Diablo 4. Oh, I forgot how to grab on this game. It's different. It's backwards from the other one. Diablo 4 is a good one. Um, I forgot. This is like demon. Uh, all right, we got that. Hold that back. That's the slam. Shao don't look like a con in the very beginning of Mortal Kombat. What do you mean? I thought Shao in his first days was pretty. The first? You mean the first edition of Shao Kahn? What do you mean? I don't understand. Oh, you mean uh, the beginning of Mortal Kombat 1? Mortal Kombat 1 doesn't look like a Mortal Kombat game. <laughs> Mortal Kombat 1. So this is a free grab. What's a free grab? It means you can do a combo into a move that will actually let you get the free grab after it. This man hit me right out of my animation. Oh, you motherfucker. Hold that back. He's absolutely playing goaded now. That Sato energy is what I want. Oh, fuck you. There we go. That Sato energy is what I'm surprised he doesn't have in the new game. I mean, like, I figured they definitely would just throw that at him. I figured that had to be uh, something they'd give him, but... Wins. Fatality. I guess that's not something they saw in the cards for Ermac on this. Uh... You need to beat that boss by distance, my friend says. All right, then. Yo, appreciate you legends hanging out with us in the chat today. Thank you for every single like, share, star, comment, sub that comes through while we are live. We're doing a little Ermac retrospective as we take a look at the character throughout the past as he's coming to Mortal Kombat 1 tomorrow. Yes, Nick, there was a combat cast today. Like, uh, yeah, like, do y'all, like, do you, I was already aware I was on early, Nick. Do you feel like you needed to tell me I was on, I was, I was on early, or do you ever think of, like, I just am genuinely curious, like, just things I noticed in streaming, like, you, like, if I come on early, like, that's, like, Instead of like looking at a description or seeing like why, like, like that's the number one thing that people say. You're on early. Yes, we are on early today. What's up, brother? We're doing the Ermac showcase for the combat cast. I posted about it in the Headlock Gaming group. I posted about it in the supporter group. I even tagged everybody in the group. So I posted it on our Twitter. I posted it uh, in the Discord too that we we're coming on early to look at this. Is this easier time for you, Nick? I know you said the other time was screwing with you. I mean, we're like 30 minutes from our usual store time. Is this not it? Goals. Me at work till four to eight. I know you said the three o'clock time didn't work for you uh, very, very well. You wish Razor Ramon was in this game? Golden one? You never know. You never know why it might come to the game. Nick, I hope you're staying safe out there from uh, all that stuff that you mentioned yesterday, my homie. Remember, man, I know it sounds fun to be around sometimes, but that stuff can get out of, out of hand sometimes. So just watch it. Round one. Fight. Let's see if we can get this. Stop, stop. 
Yo, the movement by the computer is insane. All right, stay back. Yo, look at the AI increase. What's up, Kabir? Good to see you, my friend. Welcome into the stream. Say what, lady? I was going to say, hoping to hit that. Anytime she learns her last set, set of bad guys before she dies, I'm out of health. Ah. So that's one of those wave-based games, right? Not with that. And she seems like this seems like this AI is gonna give us a real hard time when we get to the boss. Sundell's kinda it's Katana's half mom. I thought she was Katana's mom, full mom. Is she not? What do you know? What do you mean Sundell is Katana's half mom? She's the mom, right? She is the mom's, ain't she? All right, let's go. So this is the fight right here that I'm kind of wondering if this is going to be uh do I play Injustice League? No, I do not. Injustice the the game or what are you talking about? I don't play uh I don't play like a lot of stuff like that. Welcome in across all the realms legends. I appreciate you watching whether you're on Facebook, YouTube, Kick or Twitch. This is going to be a tough fight right here. Stop with that. Stop with that. Yeah, this is gonna be a hard fight. Yo, what up, Trigun? Welcome into the show. Yeah, he's going hardcore. Smoke wins. Three o'clock. Oh, you start when we start. Oh, so you literally start at the uh hang on one second. So you are starting literally when I am you're starting work when I'm starting. Nick, is that what you were saying? Yo, what's up, Joey? Is that what you're saying? Go with that. Oh, Nick, that sucks, bro. Yeah, this AI is on drugs, man. There ain't no way it's going to let us get through this. I can already tell. That's fantastic, Mark. I'm happy for you, bud. Yeah, it's not going to let me get the win. Well, you got to play it safe. When you get the new smoke on this, uh, you, you got crazy, crazy, crazy fights. New smoke's pretty, pretty tough. Mm -mm -mm. Dry gun. I'm doing well, my friend. What was that? So we're taking a look at Ermac. Ermac's combat cast just finished up a little bit ago. We came on to cover that, and then we are now checking out Ermac, and we checked out Mortal Kombat. Classic MK with Ermac. Get away from this character. You'll never get it. Oh, fuck, dude. Just... What was so frustrating about 3D Mortal Kombat was you... The moves don't work up close. And that is where the computer sits on your face. Like you can't do anything from up close. Like what I mean is overheads just all, like imagine if overheads didn't work up close in Mortal Kombat 1. That's where you need them the most, up close. In, the, in this game, overheads don't work. So the computer stays right in your face and you can't do nothing. Like it's uh, absolutely crazy. Absolutely crazy. Now, this is going to be Onaga, which I don't know if we're going to see Onaga come back. Appreciate y'all dropping likes on the video, sharing with friends. Oh, your three o'clock is differently, though, right, Nick, from my? Bro, this game just mobs you, man. It's insane. Like, if you put this on expert, this game just crushes your soul. Like, it's, uh... This game will just rush you down constantly, and there's no escape because it's typical Mortal Kombat AI where it just walks eight times faster than you. I think I can do this like this. Well, they're treating you good, Nick. Whoa! Well, that's 
perfect. It's perfect. It's perfect. Sorry, did that just not work? Hold on, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Let's go. Now we're going to Mortal Kombat 9 after this. Fight game one and two. I feel you on that, yo. I'm gonna stay over here. Whoa! Oh, big fella. He's tough. He's a tough character, man. Onaga was a beast on this. You're doing great, Trigun. How you doing? If I miss any comments, copy and paste is your friend. Welcome into the stream. Forgive me for... Uh... Damn, he grabbed us right out of that move. Oh, come on, man. I was just... Mm. That's what kills me on this game, man. You can be on the Kami Dogu and then all of a sudden you just miss it. Like, magically. Like, that was completely unacceptable, what just happened right there. Like, the Kamidogu was, we were on top of it, and it just glitched through it. Oh, get the fuck out of here. So, I mean, you can't escape the AI. Like, even on the heart, like, it's just insane. Like, Onaga is so fast, you can't escape him. He'll just walk you down. All right, let's get his alternate costume in here and see how we go yo quan chi black again thank you for those stars an hour ago thank you terry for the love and demarian thank you for the love on the stream one of you top three star centers from the stream will be going into the dra drawing for this jacket as well not this one but a new one uh where's our max alternate skin let's go let's get it let's go let's see how we go so you definitely on this game, like I said, that's the fault of the, uh, that's just how this AI is. It's just rushed down to the point where when you try to do anything, it'll just destroy you. Yo, real golden one. Thank you for the uh, stickers, my friend. Appreciate that. Let's see. So what are you legends getting into for the day? And let's see if we can do this. We like that was just robbery that oh my fucking gosh, man. It's like so fast that you can't even push buttons back in response. Is this fast enough that I can just outframe him or something? Itty bitty kitty doing good stuff. All right. Round two. Let's Fight. go with this. Look out of that. Look out of that. That's fucking ridiculous that that hits full screen. This is one of the only bosses that they've ever given us. This is the only boss. Like, you, you have to, you are reliant on the Kami Dogu to beat this character in most cases. Even with the Kami Dogu on the hardest difficulty, Melina, this fight is near impossible. You have to run the clock out in order to beat this character. So even on the, even on when you're on the hardest difficulty, if you're trying to beat that game with this game with Melina, your highest damage you can do is like 11% with a three hit combo. And you literally need to just run the clock out. Outer chamber of the Dragon King's throne room, Ermac did battle with this is actually a good ending. Enslaved comrades. Ermac was more than a match for the five warriors, but their defeat was not his objective. Now we're going to be going to Mortal Kombat 9. Their souls while Ermac occupied the rest. Eventually, all five were awakened from their enchantment and freed from Onaga's control. This is only the third time we saw her, the second time we saw Ermac. Once bring about a noble outcome. He sensed, however, that an ominous force... Which is kind of crazy to think of. The realms. It was everywhere. He could feel its influence on Onaga, though the Dragon King was oblivious to its manipulation. Time was running out. Ermac feared the celebration of this latest oh, victory Michael, would thank be you, home. I feel like the cat's about to make a move of some sort. Michael, thank you for the 500 stars. MK9, noob, Cybot. No, that was Ermac in Mortal Kombat Deception. This... 
This is one of the best outros too. By the way, who is Mike Boone? Well, you didn't see it, but Mike Boone is Ed Boone's brother. We don't see much of Mike Boone out there uh, often. Why is that? Uh, this is a... Uh... Hang on. I got to do this the right way. I got to do this the right way. Michael, thank you very much for the 500 stars. I appreciate the participation in today's stream. Whoa, man. What audience participation out there? I can't believe it. Dual screen. Um, all right. I'm hiding my login info, even though it doesn't matter. All right, now, this is a full-on game experience right here, Legends. This is Mortal Kombat 9. If you want to get down and play a real game, this is it right here. This is the one to play. This is the game. Mortal Kombat 9. I could probably play this on Expert. We're not going to, though. But we are going to get this guy's... Uh, no, I don't want to play it on Expert. It's been a minute since I played this. We're not playing it on expert. Uh, but we are going to be looking at my uh, combos for Ermac. Let me go over here and check something. If you have any characters that you want me to drop you a combo with on this game, uh, let me know. I may have some notes for the character. Back 3, 4, down, back 4, dash D2. Back 3, 4, down, back 4. Round 1. Fight! Ha! Oh, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see. So, so that's one of his BMBs. All right, so this is our Mac on him. This is the NRS era. Oh, wait, I got the game cropped all the shit. So y'all, hang on, let me fix that so you can actually see the full game. I was playing on the uh, screen window that you had uh, set up on. Um... It's not it. That's not it. There we go. Sorry about that. Cabal, brother, would love to see some Cabal. Cabal's a wonderful fighter. Down back one, one, two, one. All right. All right, all right. Wait. One, two, one, down back two. Okay. You saw how, oh man, Kratos was wild Get back in the day. Appreciate your appreciate stream of content, stream bro. Content Thank you very, very much, yo. I appreciate cool you, my guy. Skin tone, full score, saluting face fire. I like doing these streams. I know that they're not like the you know, most. They're, uh, they're, uh, appreciate you, Terry. Thank you for the thousand stars. Wait, they brought that back. That's the move that they gave him. Yo, hold on, Terry. This is going out to you, my friend. I'll be back. Yo, and you kick ass like this guy kicking Daniel LaRusso's ass, and we will be seeing Cobra Kai sometime this season. Sometime this year, I mean, I believe. Uh, that was down back one, down one, two, one. That's tricky. I can't get that. What's down back to my all time favorite fighter? Uh, I would say Scorpion. He's loyal to his family, his clan. Like, I'd be loyal to you, Legends. Let's go down here. Uh, mind over splatter. Now, this was good stuff. I need to probably. This was the Ermac right here. Now, when we got the floating Ermac on Mortal Kombat X, which we're, we're going to be checking out Mortal Kombat X, this is the last time. There was not a lot of Ermac in Mortal Kombat's history, which is kind of ironic and odd to me because I feel he's an excellent character. Like, he just seems like a... Uh, a he just seems like a badass character. I was thought. Let me try something. Okay, so that's that. That's a tricky timing to get, though. I got this on my notes, so I know it works. Uh, these are old notes that I pulled up, so... Try 3-1, 3-1. Oh, okay, I see, I see. That's definitely a tricky timing on this. 
So now I'm gonna go to my actual BNB combos that I go with on this. Uh, who is your favorite all-time fighter? So you can jump in and go into three one. Jump into three one. Wait, let me see if I can. Is this audio level? Yeah, there it is. Wait, so jump in. I'm just gonna go for my regular combos on him. My regular combos, I used to love Ermac on this game so very much. Oh, he's got the sauce too. Whoops, okay, we're good. Now this game didn't have the, uh, I didn't understand this fatality. I still don't understand it. Fatality. Between three, Noob, Ermac, and Tremor. No original, well, new Sub Zero is an original character. Now, who remembers back in the day when we had Mortal Kombat with Freddy Krueger? This is before Peacemaker and all that jazz. Y'all get Peacemaker now. We used to get home. We used to get Freddy Krueger and all this jazz. He's got very much like uh, Freddy. Back three, four. I want to learn Jax on this game. I've never learned him. He was a very uh, involved character. If you could play Jax on this game, you are a king. Jax has always been a very involved character, even going back to the classic games. Mortal Kombat 9 had the classic characters. And Mortal Kombat 9 was a badass game. That's not, that's not, it's just flashy. Like, that doesn't look, that's not worth doing. Three, two, one, three, one down, back one. Oh, what the fuck? Four, one, down. Back. That's what I'm looking for there. Okay, so I'm trying to remember. That's tricky timing on that, so I see, uh, So the one where he now I think I can go for a Bay Bality. Let's try to hit the Bay Bality on little Freddy here, because little baby Freddy is actually kind of cute. Down, down, back, down, why? It won't let me. Yeah, I didn't get the qualifications for it. I should have done it a little bit sooner for that. That is my fault. But legends, tomorrow is the day. We got a new season of invasions. It just happens to be Tuesday. We'll probably be busting out some Ermac tomorrow. Jumping through, that's the easiest way to level up Ermac is to go in invasions, level up Ermac in invasions. We'll probably be jumping in, doing everything we can possibly do to learn that character top to bottom because I have a feeling he's going to be amazing. That's the combo I was going for. So that's a nice 27 hit combo. He's got some good stuff. He's definitely got some good stuff. That's a good low starter. Uh, let me go with the back three, four, down back four. So he's got some, he's got some good stuff. That one right there is not the best. Oh, I can. Do oh, I didn't know that. Hold on. Now his special moves on this were, uh, you had your air blast, you had your force ball, port lift, force lift, force port, excuse me. Force port was actually, uh, you can enhance these. Ermac was a good character on Mortal Kombat 9 back in the day. Now, as you, uh, what's up Trigon? Are we gonna finish him? Yeah, we're gonna finish him. Stop with that. That was a cool line that he says to Johnny as well. All right, that was not what I wanted. It'll be a little quicker. This game was known for its tough inputs on combos. There we go, tight timing, I mean.
do something. Block that. Nick, did you see the end of the combat cast, bro? Oh, Nick, hey. That was a really good end of the combat cast. I wish we had brutalities on this game. It'd be absolutely amazing, but we don't. So the end of the combat cast actually showed off. Uh, can I do this? Yeah, at the end of the combat cast, they actually showed off uh what's up, Trigon? Damn it. They actually showed off his new brutality, which is slamming him into the ground over and over and over again. Beautiful, beautiful stuff. I don't mind me, my eyes itching. Now we get to Mortal Kombat X. I'm gonna need some help uh on the combo tech. I don't think I have any tech with him on MKX. I might. I gotta look. It's been forever. I don't know if I can uh so if you're an Ermac fan, you're gonna get a lot of Ermac in the next few days. Stop with that. Okay, and then I can go with this. Is this one string? I'm trying to figure this out. I'm gonna I'm gonna stop screwing that up. I promise you I'll stop screwing that up. Oh shit, well maybe I'm not. I thought Ermac looked good. He's looking interesting that he's all floaty and all that. He, he floats when he's coming towards you. Okay. Now don't forget, this is a return to a lot of things. The stage fatalities, which I'm gonna look at right here. Uh, up, down, up, up, A. This was a good stage fatality too. Somebody was asking about injustice, something. That must be one string. That must be one string that you don't delay. You can't get that out. That's a hard string. So you, you hit that into the timing of it. Can't get it. I was trying to hit, I was trying to master it on him. I guess this uh, probably is not the best time to practice on this, I would say. Crap. Yeah, I shouldn't have tried to practice on him. I still think we can get it, though. Stop that. that every fucking time. Yo, look at Sector. Going crazy. Billy, thank you for the sticker, man. I appreciate that very, very much. Coming up with 200 reactions, man. Thank you very, very much for that. Appreciate you. Hit this guy with a... Yes. Oh, did he armor that? I used to love that, too. I would have kind of loved to see that come back. I gotta look again. It was down, up, down, down, A, right? I just wanna make sure it wasn't down first. Yeah, down, up, down, down, A, all right. So like skin color Mortal Kombat one, which one? The paintball color or uh, which other one is it? Glad to see this Xbox controller charged up and working too, because this thing was not working properly yesterday. It's a, a battery pack that you don't need to charge. Did y'all know they make an Xbox battery pack that you can literally just charge like a PlayStation 5 controller? Round Fantastic stuff. Fight. So Kano's pretty difficult on this game. That's a nine hit, 27%. That's like no range at all. Kano was a lot of fun in this game. This was the classic Kano attire from back in the day. Okay, I forgot. You can't get anywhere near this bum. He also had the scorpion fly around stuff, the telekinesis. I don't see a lot of the fastness with him on the new uh, 
And that force push is interesting. It's crazy that they have not taken that. It's wild that his uh, shit. Wild that he doesn't have his force ball. So according to what I saw, Remo, what's going on? Good to see you. I played the hell out of this game. Noob is your guy in this. Kano is just so fucking mobile in this game. It's crazy. What's good, Mike? Welcome into the show. Greetings. Hello. We're taking a look at Ermac today. Ermac got revealed in the combat cast. We took a look at that earlier today. Then we took a look at Mortal Kombat or Ultimate MK3 with Ermac. Then we did Mortal Kombat Deception Ermac. Ermac is up now in Mortal Kombat 9. And we will be looking at Ermac in Mortal Kombat X as well. And I believe, did I miss Ermac anywhere, or is that it? Is that the Ermac uh, gauntlet? Done. Is there any... Oh, shit, 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 shit. She's going kind of hard here. Hang on. You got to punish on this one. This starts going hard. Damn it, really? Damn. Break back. She's gonna fall from the ceiling. Oh. Knew that was coming at some point. Damn, she's doing that constantly. Let's get it. Smoke was amazing in this. He was. Mike, how's everything going on your end, my guy? Really? That's one. Oh, really? Go wake up attack. He's spicy. Catch that on that. Smoke was amazing in this. Smoke was a little bit... Uh, this game's still online playable on the Xbox. It's just laggier than all hell. The netcode actually is the most atrocious thing of all time. It's absolutely bonkers. Thank freaking God. I wasn't... Uh, thank you, Mark. I appreciate the compliment. Just want to make sure i like the xbox controller for the clickiness that is a massive massive draw for me on this game or on this controller in general for the xbox series x it is just a massive draw for me to have this clicky controller which is just absolutely perfect there's your joy of painting back uh with bob ross kitty i can't get that shit to go off the screen but shang sung in this game absolutely devastating absolutely a devastating character Ooh, that was kind of flashy. I'm not trying to brag, but no, look at that shit. This is where he goes stupid. Quan Chi is a nut, or Shang Tsung is a nightmare on this game. Oh, wow, he jumped the opposite way and hit us. Hold that back. Ebony, welcome back in. Thank you very, very much. How are they treating you at the shift today? Oh, I wish I could smash buttons to make this work because it ain't going to kill. Oh, we did kill. Oh, my gosh. Thank goodness, and that gives me a reason to pause. This game's destroying me today. Ebony, thank you very, very much. Hold on. Let me hit you with the... Uh, you want an ice cream cone? I know you're working today. Take this ice cream cone with you. Here you go. Here we go. Frosty. Thank you so very much for the love and support. All right, I think we might be able to get this. If we get this, uh, not like that, we won't. So that's that. Jump in and back to it. Let's 
There's already half my health gone. Damn, the jumps are insane. They're just like mob jumps. We're dead. We're dead. Ain't nothing I can do. We'll hit. Oh, look at that jazz. What the fuck? Bro, you're doing too much, Shang Tsung. Did that just miss? Went through him. MK9 was a return to form from Remo. Yo, this guy is a whole fucking... Yep. Now hold back. Go with that. Finished. Is that out of range? I guess I was out of range on that. Have I played Lee Mei? Yes, I have played Lee Mei. Lee Mei. She's a fun character. Lee Mei does great stuff in Mortal Kombat 1. Very fun character. Just not my style of gameplay that I like. So now we get to take on our, our uh, Kentaro on this game. This is the last Mortal Kombat that had sub-bosses in it. After that, sub-bosses all got uh, sent to sub-boss. Uh, I don't know where they went. Kind of odd, too. I mean, sub-bosses were legit. Like... I thought they were amazing back in the day. But for whatever reason, no more sub bosses. What up, Anthony? Welcome in. His armor is brutal. Oh my god, that was close. Bro, you were fake. And you can't really hit him out of like much other than like hitting his armor. Like as he jumps. Everything he does is armor. So you gotta wait for him to do that basically. Will you check out what I sent to you? Uh I think so. Uh I guess sent a lot of stuff. Let me make sure I get check. Like, it, it, like, where's my opening? Like, everything is armored. Like, that flash you see is everything is armored. That flash is armored. 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 At least these were hard fights, man. Like, like, we don't really have a lot of, like... We got different difficulty in Mortal Kombat 1 now. We got like the 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 wacky like invasions boss, like you know, weirdness stuff floating around, all the goofiness going on, all that stuff. Uh that 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 I'm not just give me a fucking hit here. What the fuck? That's what I mean. He's armored on everything he does, so you just might as well stand there for 20 minutes and fucking... Okay, now it's our turn to attack. You cannot be in a move when he does that. Bring him up! Slam him down! Jow, are you on Xbox, my friend? If you're on Xbox, you play with us. Let me look at something while we're doing this here. I'm trying to see if I'm forgetting something. Mm, nope, absolutely not. Oh, that was right. That was right. Yeah, that's what I thought. Just making sure. Yeah, you can't. You can't do shit. Fuck. 
Damn, I knocked him out of that. Jaden, what's up? Good to see you, buddy. Welcome into the stream. I knocked him out of that. I swear I did. So that's the only way to hit him is to knock him up in that and hit him out of that. He's got other skins in this game. I wasn't a big fan of the other skins that he had in this game. I felt they were just kind of like in between. What's up, Drew? Welcome in. I posted up in the uh, Headlock Gaming group and our supporter group, and I posted in the Discord, and I posted on our Twitter that we were going on early today. What is the fucking issue here? Uh. Double that. How you doing today, though, my, my guy? Welcome in, Billy. No, I didn't know this Taven had the same voice. Bro, you, I just couldn't stand this shit, right? You'd be facing the wrong way and they'll just grab you. I'll just wait for you to fucking jump, bro. This motherfucker did not jump straight in the air and grab me midair jump. Round two, fight. Ain't no fucking way. Pull that back. So usually that does about 54% against regular players. On this, it does a little bit less. Let's see. Just jump already in like you. Thank God. If he doesn't jump, you don't really have a lot of options on him as far as like movement. Like he's like that didn't even connect, but okay. Bob that, Bob that. They could have given him like one less hit of armor, I feel like that would have been nice. Seen as is basically like undefeatable without him. Like, he's literally like armored on every attack that you do. This dude is such a beast that he's nearly invincible. Yeah. That's your opening right there. I did not notice that, uh, Noah. No, that he had the same voice. I was hoping I could break through his armor, but I guess not. I thought maybe he had like a, I guess he's got enough armor that you can't break through with enough hits. See if that's enough for him. He's gonna armor through. Yep. More armor. Yep. All right, Shao Kahn. Shao Kahn on this game was the one that you had to get through. He was the tough one. Let me make sure I'm looking at everything properly. Excellent. What's up, Oni? Welcome into the stream. Good to see you with us today. All right, Legends. We are going against Shao Kahn. We will be back at our normal time tomorrow. Don't forget, probably around four-ish. You gotta stay a web you gotta stay a step ahead of Shao Kahn on this. Whoop, that ain't a step ahead. Whoop, that ain't either. I just tried to play Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3 against them. That ain't good. Shit, my bad. I just tried to bust out an Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3 combo on him. That was brutal. Hold on. Wow, really? Yo, he's devastating. Gary, you been on MK1 lately? I was on the uh, PlayStation last night. I'm gonna have to do the jump kick mechanic. I can't even get sorted on him on the right angle for this. 
So the jump at the j hang on. This is the uppercut mechanic, but I can't even get sword on him for the right angle for it. He won't allow it. Damn, it just didn't allow it? Yo, that was kind of crazy. It allowed the first hit of the jump in, but I couldn't get the second the uppercut. That was whack. And welcome into the stream. As you're hanging out with us today, don't forget to smash that thumbs up as you come in. Let me know where you're watching from, what your plans are for the day. This is a little Ermac showcase that we are doing today. If you get booted out of the stream, just come back into the stream. Uh, sometimes Facebook does that. There we go. Wow. Mmm, the armor. I just was so adoring of the armor in these games. Sure, I didn't want my jump kick to connect anyway. I wasn't on long on the... Was it last night or the night before? I wasn't on long. Uh, I gotta go to the jump, the jump uppercut mechanic on him. He's doing too much. Working. That's the mechanic right there. He takes no damage. We got it though. Let's go. Welcome into the stream, Legends. I hope you're having a beautiful day today. As you join us around the realm, let me know where you are watching from, what you're getting into today. Hey, there we go. That's not what I wanted. There we go. We got it. We got it. This is to get the secure damage on him. This is to get some uh, the leeway on him. God, he just starts going crazy. Now, you know, if you can play uh, as Shao Kahn in the uh, modded version of this game, too. Yo, he just tried to break out of the fucking pattern. If you play this on uh, Mortal Kombat, if you play Mortal Kombat 9 on PC, you can actually get access to the fuck? That was trash. If you play this on PC, you get the modded version and uh, play as Shao Kahn. He's actually got an infinite. So, that is a... The hammer throw that he has is a straight up infinite. There we go. <laughs> It is, Terrence. Now we got 145,000 buttons and all the stuff. My encoding's overloaded for some odd reason. I don't know why, but I appreciate you letting us hanging out with us today. So now we're going to go check out Mortal Kombat X Ermac. Now, I don't have... Uh, I just got this on PS3, so... With Shao Kahn dead, Ermac was no longer bound to him. Anarchy erupted within Ermac as the many warrior souls that comprised his being struggled for dominance. Only one had the strength of will to quiet the chaos. The conflict resolved. Ermac returned to Outworld. Oh, this determined is this. To reunite with his past. Queen Sindel and Princess Katana were shocked to learn the truth. That trapped among the many spirits within Ermac was their husband and father, King Jared. Okay. Though he would never be the Jared they once knew. Ermac would forever serve and protect his queen and the Adenian people. Okay, okay, okay. Well, that's a pretty good little ending. I think that's the first time I did that with him, too. So, uh, not too shabby. Grinding MK1 seasons. So now I can go to Mortal Kombat X. I just got this on here, and it makes for easy switching. Uh, this is on sale, actually, for like $3 on the uh, Mortal Kombat on Xbox. And I'm actually playing with Ermac right here. Let's go to the main menu and let's check out some Ermac on this. Uh, let's go to the towers and we'll go to traditional towers. So this is Ermac on Mortal Kombat X. I don't know. Actually, hang on a second. Let me go back. Let me go back. Uh, let me go to. I like this on this because you can set up your fights. So you got your classic, which is really, really good. 
Let me pull up my notes with this character for MKX real quick and see how we're going. What's up, Flame? How you doing today, buddy? Welcome in Legends Across All the Realms. I appreciate you watching with us today. Don't forget exclamation point time if you ever want to extend the stream and force us to be on as long as you deem. Let me see here. Where is Ermac for this game? Do I got notes? I do got notes. Mystic is what we're starting with. I say we go against old scorpion put him in the gold Skip. scorpion mike remember that special 499 what's up bro welcome to the ermac showcase we checked out we came on a little bit early for the co combat cast we came on and did ultimate mortal kombat 3 ermac mortal kombat deception ermac mortal kombat 9 ermac and we are here we doing mortal kombat x ermac do not compare yourself back three down back one Very well. jump. one round one fight if I remember this. Bro, what is this difficulty on? Notifications suck. No, they all do, man. They all do. What's my moves here? Soul burst, he teleport. Yo, this cat's already going crazy. Four, four down, back one. I can't push a fucking butt. Oh, it's not Mortal Kombat 1. You can't air combo. I'm forgetting. I'm forgetting. I'm forgetting. So this is where he came in down back in 4 4 Okay. That's interesting. That's interesting. Now, what did he have? Damn, this is on fucking point right now. Jeez, look at this shit. Oh, I got this on one round. I got this on one round. So let me run that back. Yo, holy hell, man. This is on absolute just destroy you. Like. So that you run in and, uh, oh, you got four forward and run in and then, okay, I see, I see, I see. You can run in with that. that. That's his telekinesis. You can run in and neutral jump punch it and then uppercut it. Still does shit damage. There you go. Afternoon. What's up? You had an awesome birthday yesterday. That's what's up, my guy. Happy happy birthday from Headlock to you. I hope it was amazing yesterday. So this was the Ermac that a lot of people are familiar with that came into the franchise. Oh, I got this jack to fuck up audio wise on. Uh, let me go over here and turn this down just a little bit. I apologize. Move list, finishing moves. I did have this pulled up somewhere that I need to look at real quick. Uh, let's go to, we're gonna go down, up, back, mid. Oh yeah, I remember this. This was fucking horrible. Right. So down up back from mid distance. This is a really hard timing to nail. Like you gotta do the wildest stuff on this. Now tomorrow is a new season. Tonight we might go live with our supporter group. We might do ranked in Mortal Kombat 1. I don't know. Is this, is this live or GH day? Oh man. What is GH day? What's up, buddy? How you doing today, Zim? What what is GH day? Uh, fill me in. Did you Groundhog Day? What's up, Zim? Is it Groundhog Day? Is that short for Groundhog Day? Let me see what the Final Revenge Premium Tower is. What is this? Final Revenge? You will no longer be bound by Quan Chi in a sort of Groundhog Day. Okay, GH day. Everybody's somebody said something yesterday that was a new trendy saying. Uh oh wait, 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 wait. Uh fighter select. Where's fighter select? Tower select. Somebody said a three uh word the other day that I a new trend. Oh, am I forced to do this with this character? Oh, that's kind of balls. So I'm forced to do this with this character. So that's not good. Y'all gonna be eating anything tonight? Let me know what you should get for what I should get for dinner. Uh, the Premier Tower, Final Revenge. That sucks, man. It makes you do the, all these towers with these specific characters. All right, well, we'll go back and do the regular one then. 
What's up, Joshua? Welcome in. So I was checking that right there. Uh, we'll go back here and we'll do another fight with Ermac real quick. Just to showcase him a little bit. Classic skin, Pharaoh Ermac. Look ridiculous. Mystic was good. He had this. Atari Jaguar Mortal Kombat just came out today, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, today or yesterday or tomorrow. I could be mistaken, but I believe it is. So, there's somebody is porting the Atari, the arcade version of uh, Mortal Kombat to Atari, and it is absolutely bonkers what they put together. Like, I mean, it's crazy. Damn, this is already fucking insane to touch. This is on medium difficulty. I sound different today. Uh, my mic sounds uh, different. Uh, Hopefully it's not a filter on or anything like that. Hopefully the mics are. Jeez, man, this is insane, dude. This isn't even like... This is medium difficulty. Holy fucking hell. What's up, Raja? Good lord, man. Medium difficulty is absolute gobsmacked. Where's Careless Whisper? Oh, that's a star screen scene. Bro, just give me a trade or something. Holy fucking crap sauce. What is my string here? Like, this is insane. Y B A Y Y Y Y. Okay. God damn it. Woo! Yo, it just goes bonkers. So I got to lab with this character a little bit. Uh, now you can do your telekinesis into... Off that. What's up, Jeff? Welcome into the stream. We started off a little early today taking a look at Ermac in the new combat cast. And we did Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3 with Ermac. And then we jumped over to do some Ermac in Mortal Kombat Deception. And then we did some Ermac in Mortal Kombat 9. And this is Ermac in Mortal Kombat X. And his other fatality is the one that is listed right here, which is actually a little bit easier. It's actually a good fatality, too. Rips his head out, shoves it in his stomach, rips it out. Good stuff. Ermac wins. Fatality. Fatality. Now, as you come into the stream, don't forget to drop a like on the video, share with a friend. Thank you for letting everybody come in, or thank you to everybody that comes in with us today. This is just Round one point. quick look at Ermac. I'm going to knock this character off the stage, and then that will be our Ermac showcase for the day today. This is definitely a hard uh, fucking Mortal Kombat. Man. Oops. I keep forgetting out of the so do that. All right, you got that. That can be count. You can run in and do the uppercut, or you can actually uh, this MK kind of looks creepy. My, it's very very dark. Um, very dark MK. What's up, Eric? Welcome to the stream, brother. Now he did have brutalities on this. Uh, they're all locked on this. Uh, Raymond, what's up, buddy? They're all locked on this except this first one right here. Must perform 10 specials during the end match. Well, let's find out. Air Force port. That's, uh, well, that's doable. We'll try the Air Force port. Let's see. If we... And he broke it like a day. Pharaoh, you think Pharaoh was a good costume for this? I don't know if I enjoyed the Pharaoh uh, aesthetic for Ermac. You know, there's an interesting... Well, I can't. It's it's not. It's... It's kind of gross. Like, there's a thing about ancient Egyptian history that, uh... Like, shout out to all the mummies out there. There's a great episode of Quantum Leap where they went to the uh, ancient Egypt... When they went to ancient Egypt. And, uh, there, if you know what I'm talking about... What's up, Daniel? If you know what I'm talking about, there was a great episode of Quantum Leap where they went to the pyramids and, uh... 
I just want to do air combat right there. So now it's addictive. Now it's like super addictive and I want to do it every time I can in the game. Okay, so now I'm gonna try to do this brutality and it should work, I hope. Uh, it doesn't mean I gotta be it. Nope, nope, nope. Uh, so that unfortunately, I had to do 10 specials to get that to work. Uh, this is down up back. So down up makes you jump and then you gotta hit back, which is really, really awkward all the way around. And oh, this game had weird, weird, weird inputs on that. What's the easiest finisher? Uh, ones that only have a couple button inputs in them and don't have the. Uh... He looks good. This is his old. This is his old uh, skin. So I got to go through this game, and I haven't unlocked anything in this yet. This is on the Xbox side. We can go through and do an unlock on this game. Uh, this is the Crypt for Mortal Kombat back in the day on MKX. Now, I, we got to do the whole Crypt. If y'all want to do this sometime, we can do the whole Crypt together. We already got 18,000 coins. Uh, I wasn't a big fan of that, navigating this Crypt, but, I mean, it is what it is. So, if you want to check out uh, Mortal Kombat's Ermac, we just went through and checked out Mortal Kombat's Combat Cast. I, by the way, I got this game the other day. I don't know what the hell this game does. Uh, I'll even show you all this as a bonus before I get ready to go here in a second. I don't know what this game is, but earlier today we checked out the combat cast for Ermac. Then we went and played Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3 with Ermac. Then we played Mortal Kombat Deception with Ermac. Ultimate, we'll, we'll play Mortal Kombat 9, Mortal Kombat X with Ermac. So this is a... I don't want to understand this game at all. Player versus CPU, right? That should be like single player, right? Like, I'm blown away. I don't understand this game. So I select it, right? But then I can't do anything here. Like, once you get here, when you hit player versus player, no button works. Like, nothing works. It's like the controller is just dead. I can't go back. I can't do forward. I have no idea what this game is. I don't know if it's a, this is like eight cents in the store. There was no YouTube videos on it and nothing on it. So I got it and uh, player versus player. This I can select a character with player two. So it's registering like like a player one controller somewhere. CPU versus just show me what the fucking game looks like. See, I can't even do that. I don't know, is this like a test demo? I, I don't know what I bought. It's like eight cents. So if you want to check out this game, uh, just checked out that original MK on the Jaguar. It looks really, really impressive. Ghostbusters is still online to this day too. If you ever want to get down on Ghostbusters, that is a really good game. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to get wrapped up right there, get myself sorted and the little itty bitty kitty sorted. Keep those notifications on. We came on today with an Ermac showcase a little bit earlier to take a look at the combat cast with Ermac and Mortal Kombat 1, who is coming tomorrow. Today is the last day to get all your stuff in the season of Mortal Kombat's uh, season of Melina. Allegedly, kind of looked like season of Ermac because we had, or season of Havoc. But, um, Ermac was going to be a base roster character, apparently, too. Your premium shop has all these wonderful items in it right now if you're into the premium shop stuff. If you are an online player or you're playing invasions, you literally have hours left to go in invasions and get everything done. Uh, this is the last few days. Have I tried Terradrome? Yes. I had a problem with the controls on that. So, Titanly May is gone. You got uh, less than 18. You got 18 hours to 100% complete all these mesas. I think I heard them say the gateway was going to be unlocked by default. That's amazing. I hope that's the case. That This this should be unlocked by default. Um, but we'll see. I got to go see if how many far I got to go on this uh, seasonal tower too. I got to do the seasonal tower like 100 times. But yo much love y'all take care stay safe headlocks heading out for now but as i always say at the end of these streams remember my friends we're all in this thing called life together so please take care of yourselves take care of each other be good to one another head out there in the realm spread some love and positivity do some great things headlocks heading out for now but as always i will see you on the next mortal Kombat video take care stay safe 
and I will see you legends again very, very soon. Thank you again and head locked out. Peace and take care and thank you.